someone who's really done well in business mm. and understands how, how it works, the structure and, and everything, because that's what we need to get right at the FA, the structure, because some of the farces we've had with Wembley uh, and, and other I issues, um, uh, suspensions and booking, yep. all this is what we discuss. It's going to be run by someone like that, and then what are us just respected, not just in this country, us respected around the world who can communicate and have relationships with other boards. And then... Um, in their protest to try and out President Ali Abdullah Saleh. Um, the big fighting that started last week has taken things to a, to a new level and there's much better. This fighting is Yemen's most powerful tribe and the longer this goes on, the greater potential it has to drag in more numbers and other tribes um, in, in this part of the country. And, and possibly tip, tip us into a state of civil war here. Mm. And uh, I know the United States are still keeping uh, a firm eye on what's going on there, aren't they? Urging President Saleh yesterday to move Yemen. Yeah, don't get me wrong. and disgorged this academic revolution led by E.P. Thompson. So tell me the effect, the impact of that book, The Making of the English Working Class, which was, I think, published in the 1960s. I think the important thing about it was that, in a sense, Thompson came at it, he was an English Marxist, and he came at it and said, there has not been told the story of this fantastic courageous...